Hi, hello viewers. Welcome to my channel. Today I am going to explain isomerism in coordination compound. First of all, what is isomerism? The term isomerism was given by Berzelius and it's represent of existence of two or more compounds with the same molecular formula but different structure and properties. The properties mean physical and chemical properties. Compounds exhibiting this isomerism are called isomers. The difference in properties of two isomers is due to difference in the arrangement of atom within their molecules. So isomerism is broadly divided into two types, structural isomerism, stereoisomerism. Structural isomers, the coordination compounds with same formula but have different connections among their constituent atoms are called structural isomers or constitutional isomers. Most probably, the structural isomerism is applied in organic chemistry. It is classified into following types, chain isomerism, position isomerism, functional isomerism, metamers isomerism, tartaromers isomerism, ring chain isomerism. But, Structural isomerism in coordination compound, it is classified into ionization isomerism, hydration isomerism, linkage isomerism, coordination isomerism. Ionization isomers. This type of isomers arise when an ionizable counter ion itself can act as a ligand. The exchange of such counter ions with one or more ligands in the coordination entity will result in ionization isomers. These isomers will give different ions in solutions. For example, consider the coordination compound. In this compound, both bromine and chlorine have ability to act as a ligand and the exchange of these two ions result in a different isomers. In solution, the first compound gives bromine ions while the latter gives chlorine ions and hence these compounds are called ionization isomers. Solvate isomers The exchange of free solvent molecules such as water, ammonia, alcohol, etc. in the crystal lattice with a ligand in the coordination entity will give different isomers. These type of isomers are called solvate isomers. If the solvent molecule is water, then these isomers are called hydrate isomers. For example, the complex with chemical formula, first one, three chlorines are present in the outside. Second one, two chlorines and one hydrate molecule present in outside. Third one, one chlorine, two hydrate molecules present in outside. So the colors are vary. Violet, pale green, dark green. Linkage isomers. These type of isomers arise when an ambidentate ligand is bounded to the central metal atom through either of its two different donor atoms. In the below mentioned examples, the nitrate ion is bound to the central metal atom, cobalt, through a nitrogen atom in one complex and through oxygen atom in other complex. Coordination isomers. These type of isomers arise in the coordination compounds having both the cation and anion as complex ions. The interchange of one or more ligands between the cationic and the anionic coordination entities result in different isomers. For example, in the coordination compound here, the ligands ammonia and cyanide were bound respectively to cobalt and chromium while in its coordination isomers they are reversed. Next, stereoisomers. Similar to organic compound, coordination compounds also exhibit stereoisomerism. The stereoisomers of a coordination compound have the same chemical formula and the connectivity between the central metal atom and the ligands. 
but they differ in the spatial arrangement of ligands in three dimensional space they can be further classified as geometrical isomers and optical isomers geometrical isomers geometrical isomerism exists in heteroleptic complexes due to different possible three dimensional spatial arrangement of the ligand around the central metal atom this type of isomerism exists in square planar and octahedral complexes in square planar complexes of the form ma2b2 and ma2bc where a b and c are monoligands and m is the central metal ion like similar groups present either on same side or opposite side of the central metal atom it's give rise to two different geometrical isomers and they are called cis and trans isomers respectively look at these examples ma2b2 the cis isomer the ammonia and chlorine are same side trans it is in opposite side ma2bc here the ammonia same side but the chlorine bromine it is a different one like the next one trans it is in opposite side of the ammonia the next one m x y twice here ammonia it's opposite side in trans same side in cis the last one m a b c d here the ligands four are different so it is a, having three different type of isomers next octahedral complexes octahedral complexes of the type m a 2 b 4 m x x twice b 2 so cis trans isomerism here a and b are mono denote ligands and x s is bi denote ligands with two same kind of donor atoms in the octahedral complexes the position of the ligand is indicated by the following numbering scheme so look at this scheme 1 2 3 4 5 6 so likewise the ligands are placed so in the above scheme the position 1, 2 1, 3 1, 4 1, 5 2, 3 2, 5 2, 6 3, 4 3, 6 4, 5 4, 6 and 5, 6 or identical and if two similar groups are present in the any one of this position the isomer is referred as a cis isomer similarly the positions 1, 6 2, 4 and 3, 5 are identical and if similar ligands are present in these positions it is referred as a trans isomers look at this example if the three similar ligands are present around the meridian which is an imaginary semi circle form one apex of the octahedral to the opposite apex as shown in the figure the isomer is called as a meridional isomer mer isomer this is called meridional because each set of ligands can be regards as lying on the meridian of the octahedron look at this image the octahedral complexes of the type m a3 b3 also shown geometrical isomerism if the three similar ligands are present in the corners of the one triangular face of the octahedron and other three ligands are present in the opposing triangular face then the isomer is referred as a facial isomers next optical isomerism the coordination compounds which possess chirality exhibit optical isomerism similar to organic compounds the pair of two optically active isomers which are mirror image of each other are called enantiomers their solutions rotate the plane of the plane polarized light either clockwise or anti clockwise 
and the corresponding isomers are called D dextro rotary and L levo rotary forms respectively the octahedral complexes of type M XX thrice M XS twice AB and M XS twice B2 it's exhibit optical isomerism i think now you clear for basic concepts of isomerism if you have any doubt ask in the comment box thank you for watching kindly subscribe and support my channel